Happy Wednesday, everyone. Hump day, as they say. <laughs> um, this is a pick a card reading for today, November 8th, Wednesday. You pick a card, it's your main energy, but I do pull them all together. Cards are for all of us. And if you were born today, November 8th, babies, we will do a reading for you next. If you pick card number one, you have the Page of Swords. Watch your words today. And people around you could be frustrating too or very blunt in speech. Okay, so I do pick that energy up. For some of you, this is a new idea, a new proposition, but it's going to take time for it to come to fruition. So if you start something, you want instant results, it's going to take some time. There can be some news about delays in money that's owed to you or money you've been waiting for. Okay, today also indicates slow and steady wins the race and haste makes waste. So I do feel that. Someone could be watching your progress and observing you as well. So I do feel that energy. Card number two. You have a major arcana of the world card. So this is an important day for you. Expect the unexpected. Fortune and luck is on your side. There is a shift of energy. Financial independence today. Um, you are going to be rewarded somehow. Money coming in rewards. Um, maybe somebody gifts something to you. I do feel some fortunate energy coming in with your money situation. Home as well. Work, career, beautiful energy. You are very independent and self-sufficient today and people are going to notice that too. So there's a big shift of energy today too. Love, lucky in love somehow too. Your passion, your values, are coming through. There's a deep love and a choice today. Strength, more harmonious ener energy. I see more balance with the home and even you're delegating some of your responsibilities. Things are changing. If you pick card number three, you have the Hierophant, a major arcana, important day for you as well. Review things. Be creative today. Manifestation is high. It's going to come with delays, though. Give things about three months, at least, is what I'm picking up. Follow your intuition. This is also an energy of the unexpected and change. It's time to tie up some loose ends and move forward. Some of you may be getting ready to leave a group or club or an organization. You're moving on to something better. All right, so when we're looking at this today, as above, so below. It's the beginning of new projects, creative endeavors today, taking action. Our willpower will get us through. Getting what we want. Some of us, there is... This energy of your intuition will help you get what you want. So follow your intuition. Overall, things coming unexpected, victory and success when we least expect it. Communications are strong today too. What we communicate, whether it's affirmations, our thoughts, or communications with others are powerful as well. Okay, that's the reading for today, Wednesday November 8th. Have a fabulous Wednesday. Happy birthday if you're born today, November 8th. This is a quick and general reading. This is your solar, your theme, and that is your wish card. Your solar, your theme is the three of wands. There are loose ends and things that still need to be wrapped up before you can move forward. Don't do half-ass jobs, okay? Um, follow through is going to be important. You start something, follow through, or you're going to have Loose ends. I keep hearing loose ends, loose ends. This is also, you're ready to move forward, but you're still looking back somehow. And this is also um, looking at how things worked out for you. Making some corrections as you move along. Teaching and learning is coming up here. I do feel there's going to be a sudden breakthrough and a massive change in your situation this year. You have a new beginning with love. High creativity. 
You're going to have new feelings about some situations in your life. Some of you, there's going to be a proposal, a significant one, whether it's work or it could be a proposal for marriage. The past is showing up. Things that you have manifested from the past could be coming through as well. A group of people from the past may be coming up as well. Could be dealing with a Scorpio, Aquarius, Sagittarius, and Capricorn this year. Moving on from childhood conditioning. Children are in focus this year as well. You can manifest a lot too. Dealings with high institutions, education, um, hospitals, all of that is coming through. There can be some conflicts and disagreements. You're not going to agree with everyone. Competition is surrounding you. But you are ready to win at all costs. This is a year of also people situations leaving your life. And these are people who are of abusive, we're not good for you, abusive relationships and elimination. I do feel here too, you could be highly defensive. There's a lot of exaggeration, feeling instability at times too. Be careful of theft or plagiarism. Nurture yourself, nurture your growth, and keep moving forward. Your wish for your solar year is the Four of Cups. You have more options than what you think. There is something in the works for you here. Nurture whatever this wish is. It will come to fruition with a delay. For some of you, it's divine timing. So it may not be this year, but it will come to fruition. Important numbers for your solar year. Five, one, six, 55, 16, three. I hope you have a wonderful birthday and a Blessed solar year ahead and beyond. Everyone else, a fabulous Wednesday. Talk to you tomorrow.